All right, fools, so we're back for more Duelist of the Roses. We just got taken down Ishtar in the Isle of Man. Funny how, it, oh, yeah, you're gonna fight this powerful woman in the Isle of Man. <laughs> All right, whatever, though. Uh, so we're ready to dominate old fuckboy Richard Slyshin of York. Uh, we're gonna be looking pretty solid here. He's like, oh, yeah, you've got rose cards. Oh, ho, ho, ho. He thinks we're one of Pegasus's Rose Crusaders because we have all these white rose cards. Oh, okay. So he doesn't realize that we're his fucking mortal enemy. Okay, so yeah, Yugi's here, so he's rushing his troops to the front. Because we're in Britain right now. Yugi's was from France. They're, the France is yeah, down to the south. Alright, so he showed up much too early. It'll be some time before Pegasus and his men arrive, okay? Let's do a duel or two. Alright, well, sure. Oh, he's learned some, some some stuff from Seto. So everyone, like Pegasus, uh, Richard here, they all learned their craft from Seto. All right, so yeah, this field, it's just mountain along the outside and then a bunch of meadow on the middle. Um, now, his battle steer, I think he's got, yeah, extended support range, movement boost for same type friendlies, level cost reduction summoning same type that's really useful so i'm gonna keep some distance and let's try and build some shit up didn't get anything too great um although i will actually bring out this blue-eyed silver zombie well no i don't know because i could use the blue-eyed silver zombie to turn sword stalker into a zombie but Sword Soccer does get a power-up bonus from uh, the meadow, so. Okay, there we go. There's a pumpkin. All right, let's get Gravity Bind out, and let's just send, start sending that up towards him. Uh, yeah, I think I am... Oh, yeah, if he's doing shit like this, combos and power increases, I want a couple of pumpkins now. I'm ready for some pumpkins. Okay, well... We're going to go ahead and put Gravity Bind out in the middle of that to stop that bullshit you just did. Uh, let's go ahead. Ooh, Pumpkin gets... Uh, he gets a level down in Mountain. All right. Um... Yeah. All right, so let's get Pumpkin down. Pumpkin is going to get a little stronger there. All right, now we can start building him up. Uh, I probably, if I could draw another pumpkin soon, then I will flip the blue-eyed silver zombie and change sword stalker to a zombie. But I don't know. I want to be careful of doing that. Yeah, fuck you. Judge man? Yeah, right. Get out of here with your little judge man. So now it's eternally spellbound and a lot weaker. So now it's just a sitting duck so I can dominate it. What do we got? Oh. Mirror wall, huh? Yeah, sure. Let's uh, let's bring that out. Uh, Blue-eyed silver zombie. Since they're so weak, I'll just get them on the meadow. That does suck that I'm weak on the mountain. Although I don't, there's not a lot of characters that use mountain. I think especially on this side of the story. Uh, when we do the other side. Oh damn! Are you just gonna walk over the judge man and get rid of it? That's gonna suck. Uh, okay, so we can... We're not gonna need that. I could use the Magician of Faith. Alright, so let's let's bring out the Sword Stalker. I am gonna do this, so we'll, we'll change Sword Stalker into a uh, Zimbimbo. And then next turn, I'll drop that Violet Crystal on him, making up the difference. All right, so what do you got going on, Richard? What are you going to do? I'm pretty sure his style is just, like, really powerful attacking move forward. A stark contrast from what we just went through with uh, Pegasus and Ishtar, where their strategies was... Ooh, nice. Their strategy was, you know, lots of trap cards, terrain bullshit, powerful magic shit. All right, so Sword Stalker, we can move him up. Yeah, you're still chilling. Uh, we're gonna have... We're gonna try and get Haishin to attack the Sword Stalker. So that our mirror wall will go ahead and cut his attack in half. And then that will be a huge decrease. 
to his life points. Oh, look at him. He is really making a push towards us. Uh, I would like... To, well, oh, Pumpkin's already at 3,200, so... Uh, cool. We got another Pumpkin. Uh, I'll put that right here. Uh, we don't need you. We're not gonna need Hinotama, and we'll bring out Pumpkin. Alright, cool. Uh, let's get Mirrorwall over in this corner. Damn, I actually wish Mirrorwall was over here now, but whatever. Uh, so Blue-Eyed Silver Zombie's just slowly getting stronger as well. He might actually flip and kill the Blue-Eyed Silver Zombie now that I'm looking at the, uh, the map here. Let's see what he does. Yep, yep, I figured, I figured. Alright, there's Mirrorwall, though. So now I can get rid of that. Oh, it's another Judgment, alright. Yeah, so he's going to get rid of our blue-eyed silver zombie. Oh, we get to see the metal. Have we seen metal yet? We might not have. What places have we not seen? Uh, we haven't seen mountain. Oh, boy. Oh, the double mace. That's rough. I'm sorry, blue-eyed silver zombie. You did good, though. You you just you made our sword stalker a lot more powerful. Your sacrifice will not be in vain. You will be a Oh, look at him taunting. Did you just see that shit? Do you, you think you're going to get away with that, Mr. Judge Man? Okay. I remember when the Judge Man was in the anime. Uh, that was in the... Uh, actually, it was in that filler arc where they used uh, deck leaders and shit. Oh, fuck. I just realized. Damn. Uh, I'm going to have to put something here to block me. Uh, we will put... Uh, so this will give me any magic card. Okay. Ah, damn it. Because I want to get rid of... Oh, fuck. Um, okay, so... Pumpkin is going to move that way. You're going to move up that way. I got to start easing over this way. Especially because he can move two spots. And we're just going to put Call of the Haunted down here. Uh, just to prevent him from getting to me. Uh, we'll have Sword Stalker take care of this Judge Man here. Alright, so what is Sword Stalker at? 39! Not bad! Uh, this isn't the Judge Man that taunted us, though. So, while I am going to enjoy his death, I'm gonna revel in his death. Uh, it's not gonna be, like, you know, my greatest pleasure ever. But like I was saying, so yeah, in that one filler arc in Yu-Gi-Oh! Where they use deck leaders and shit... There's the big five. They were like uh, members of the board, the board of Kaiba Corporation, and they tried to sell Kaiba out to Pegasus and gain control of the company and all that. And eventually, their souls get trapped in like virtual reality or whatever. And so they each, the five of them are in different dual monsters, and the one dude is in a Judge Man. Uh, wow, I just, <laughs> I just dominated you, actually, didn't I, Richard? That episode, the, that, that fight was kind of interesting because that dude, he was like a lawyer. So, of course, he, he used Judgment. Oh, there you go. Um, and he was, wow, all defense, huh? Damn. All right, but he was, uh, he was a lawyer and he was cheating. It was bullshit. Fuck. Come on, man. Uh, all right, so here's what we're going to do. We're going to flip the two of you. Oh, he taunted. Can I really let him get away with that? I need to uh, get Green Kappa out. Build him up. Now, Green Kappa is a warrior, so he is stronger in the meadow. Uh, whose power is he going to... He's going to get Sword Soccer's power. Okay. Sword Soccer will take care of this. M Warrior number two. What is this? Magic Warrior number two? Okay. Well, hey, guess what? Magic Warrior number two... You're magic warrior dead. The sword stalker really does just handle all of my dirty work. That's right, I do have a second sword stalker too. That'll be good because I'll, I'll have a zombie sword stalker. And I can also have a... Normal warrior sword stalker. He does have some nice pearly whites too, huh? 
All right, Richard. What do you got now? Uh, all right, so we're looking good over there. Yeah, he knows he can't attack because I got that mirror wall out. Well, actually, I don't know. The AI, they are dumb. They do like to just walk into shit anyway. I don't know if now that we're further in the game, if they will be able to comprehend that I've got the mirror wall out. That I'm not too sure on. And of course, I'm going to wait as... Oh my god, you're really just going to wall up? I thought you were aggressive. I'm, what? You're supposed to be aggressive, you fuck. Okay, what do we got? Nothing. Nothing. Is green cap is not... Oh, he is dark. Okay. So, we could do this. Uh, ooh, Sword of Dragon Soul? Warrior monsters automatically destroy dragons! Good thing I don't have any dragons, except for Siryu. Oh, that he did that to that Judge Man, right? I think so. Legendary Sword. Warrior monsters of light and earth? So it's saying it'll power up light, earth, and warrior monsters? Or it's gotta be a warrior that's light or earth? That's That one's kinda hard to tell. Uh, yeah, let's grab a... Well, wait, wait, wait. His attack will automatically change to it. So if I power him up, yeah, that's just going to be a waste. Okay. Oh, wait. I just backed out of that, so I didn't get the... Oh, God damn it. Sword Stalker, just handle your business up here, please. Pentha Wodia! Oh, here we go. Yeah, Joey slash Jonochi. He used this one all the time. In the normal card game, it, it's it's kind of solid because it's got really good attack for a four star monster, but you do need to uh, tribute a monster to attack. I remember the very first time uh, he used it, he actually used it with the scapegoat magic card, and he was able to sacrifice those. And he that was when he was fighting uh, the rare hunter, the nameless rare hunter. All right, Sword Stalker's got you on your heels, so now, fucker. Okay, I think it's time that we, uh... We made some headway and stopped this dude. Okay, yeah, this Judge Man's dead. Bye, fucker. Hey, remember when you were taunting? I do! Go ahead. Do that Pokemon wheezing attack! Yeah! Barf! You're dead. Blah. Yeah, aren't you so glad you taunted now, fucker? Spoiler, he's not. Oh! What a scary battle cry that is, pumpkin. Whoa, whoa. Okay, so now uh, I really, I really have got to start moving up towards him. We're just gonna move that, green kappa, all of this shit. Because now he's going to run and all this shit is in defense mode. I guess this is what I get. Ooh, nope, he fucked up. Because Green Kappa is going to be able to move two spaces. It's over. Oh, he didn't move. Okay. So we can have Sword Stalker take out his Battle Steer. Or I could be really fun. Duh. And take advantage of this. Boom! He didn't see that Oh, but it was just like a magic card. All right, well, bye. So we beat- Oh, what? No! Sword Stalker! Oh, I did not- I did not see that coming. Attack a fourth- Wait, what? His attack was 4,000! Oh, wow. Zombies power down on mountains. Sword Soccer's attack was 4,200. He stepped here, and it dropped to 3,700. He knew. That's why he didn't move. You've got to be fucking kidding. I would love to get that card. Whoa, that's good. Okay, but... Yeah, I hope you had fun, because uh, now the boys are closed. Well... Yeah, you're still kind of weak, so you can keep powering up. The boys are closing in now, though. Uh, I actually... W okay, so if he's using traps like that, then guess what we can do? 
is we'll bust out Royal Decree. I should have used this sooner, and we'd be done right now, damn it. Alright, we can... We should be able to close in on him pretty quickly here, though. And I'll, I'll send Siryu alongside the outside. Oh, nope, not, not you, not you, not you. Oh, change of heart! Never mind, I think we could probably finish this right now. Let's, uh... Give it a try, shall we? Yeah, this is where change of heart gets really useful. What is this? If it's got an attack of 1,300, I win. And this is... Another fucking acid trap hole. Can I flip this? Just ruining it? Uh, it's limited range. When it says limited range, it's probably like two or something. So let me not move Green Kappa closer. But yeah, Green Kappa's gonna stay put. You are gonna start powering shit up. Let me see. So that Acid Trap, it's really gonna just stay there like that? Oh wait, I'm an idiot. I've got Royal Decree. Ugh. Royal Decree is out. Oh, but if he's gonna start moving forward. Nothing to be scared of. Let's go. Uh, pumpkin. Eh, your attack is still not good enough. Uh, let's go. Oh, no, 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 no. Not, not, not you, not you. Let's get Siryu down. And move alongside the mountain two spots. And we'll get you closer. Okay, so this should probably end next turn, then. Yeah, because he's just hell-bent on not moving at all. He really thinks his bitch-ass, like, warriors are just going to be so... Well, he doesn't know I have Royal Decree yet, I guess. Now he does. Ha <laughs> ha. Where are you going for? Oh, another trap! Power increase! Oh, shit! <laughs> that sucks for you! Yo, I'd love to get my hands on that. Sword of Dark Destruction? Yeah, power... Oh, but it's gotta be... Oh, yeah, I think it's gotta be Warrior Monsters again. Oh, okay. Wow, that's a damn shame for him. I just got... It made me stronger. ha! <laughs> Uh, ooh, you know what? His guys are kind of a little close. Let's back up a little bit here. <laughs> he has got to be so salty from that. Like, oh, come on! Really? Wait, but he could see that my green kappa was coming. So he knew what was going to happen. What a knucklehead you are. Oh, cool. We're going to see the mountain uh, area. This is like... The only place we haven't seen yet. Now this, this looks exactly like the area that Piccolo is training in when Frieza arrives on Earth in Dragon Ball Z. Oh, that was a really cool attack, actually. Rude Kaiser's like, oh fuck, that really hurt. Yeah, suck my nuts. Sayaru doesn't give that shit. Alright, so Pumpkin will get rid of Acid Trap Hole. Okay, Green Cat. Oh, no, I should have Pumpkin go right to Damn it. Uh, okay, so... Yeah, we'll have Green Cat go over there then. Well, unless... You better put something in Sayaru's way. Or else you're done. Yes, go... Go, you know, make sure to go press those. Oh, you're done. CRU's got you. Uh, let's get a little experience for the pumpkin before we... Oh, no, 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 wait, wait. Not quite, not quite. Uh, so we'll have you go there. Pumpkin will take care of this. Another Rude Kaiser. Yeah, we've seen a million of these Rude Kaiser fights. 
So the rude Kaiser dies. We know that. Okay, now it's over. He's got nowhere to go now. We got this boy boxed in. That royal decree really is so helpful once I've built my uh, power up. And I can just put that down. And it's like, yeah, fuck all your defenses, bitch. We got you. Uh, still not able to finish it. Uh, let's have Pumpkin, you know, do the damage to him. Uh, I do want to do it this way because this will help Pumpkin level up. Because I bet if Pumpkin levels up one more time, we're actually going to get some uh, leader bonuses. Although Pumpkin really doesn't do a lot of the damage for us. It's Green Kappa, Sword Stalker, Aqua Dragon. But when I can, I do like for Pumpkin to uh, do a little business. Yep, Battle Seer. That's what's going to happen to your uh, deck leader very soon, okay? Oh, that's that battle cry! <laughs> what, what kind of scary pumpkin monster is this? We're in a Halloween movie right now. Oh, wait, wait! Yes! I just beat him! I beat him because he can't move. He can't do anything. Yeah! This, this is uh, one of the ways you could win. If the enemy deck leader can't move or summon anything, it's a W. Watch. There's nothing he can do, so he automatically loses. <laughs> yes! Yes, 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 yes! We win! Awesome. Oh, uh, does he have anything we want? Oh, we'd like to get that Acid Trap pull. Oh, Acid Trap pull's not in there, is it? No, it's not. Wait, is that it? No, Acid Trap pull's not in there. Okay, that sucks. Legendary Sword, whatever. Yeah, okay. So, Acid Trap pull. Yeah, because it did say it kills anything with an attack below 4,000. That's really, really good. He always oh, making that same face from when I beat his ass in Forbidden Memories. He says, holy shit, you're pretty strong. Don't let it bother you. Oh, you're a beginner, huh? How will you perform on the bat? Oh, right, because there's an actual war about to happen. Uh, with the support of, that's Pegasus and the Rose Crusaders. He thinks he's going to be able to beat Yugi's forces. Oh, it's not going to be that easy. What? Who? Say what? Where? When? Yo, Pegasus, what's up? You have a really sick outfit on, Pegasus. Aside from Seto, all the Rose Crusaders have fallen. That's true. We beat them all. So Seto has the last uh, Rose card. The Rose Duelist! He's like, oh, shit! So what? Oh, and he, he double-crossed him! Oh, are we in a Yakuza game right now? Damn, so you're... Yeah, he's like, no, what the fuck happened? Damn. Oh, we taught him the true meaning of power. We beat his ass so bad. Even more powerful than Seto. Yugi is going to succeed in landing his troops, and he's going to claim the throne. All right. I would be a fool not to back the winning horse. Oh, Pegasus, smart boy. He's saying, Richard boy, you must do something. Hostage, son. Oh, you can't kill my son if all your troops are dead, bitch. Oh, my. Oh, we got a legit battle. Let's go. Yep, the final battle of the War of Roses, okay. Sometime later. Oh, that's Richard's hat. A horse? What about a horse? My Kingdom 4. Oh, yeah, my Kingdom 4 a horse. Yep, Richard 3 dies. That's Pegasus picking up the crown. And putting it on Yugi's spiky head. 
from the temples of this wretch have I Oh yeah, here we go. And make much of it. You're the king now, Yugi! Just like went 3,000 years ago when you were the pharaoh. Oh, this is weird. My thanks to you, Atem. What? Wait, isn't that your name? What? Yeah, Lord Crawford helped a lot. Yup, true, true, true. He's so hell. Yeah. After I got my ass beat by the Rose Duelist, I knew I never wanted to lose again. That despicable Seto! He's at Stonehenge. Oh, so they don't have the power to beat him, so they're gonna have to ask the Rose Duelist to do it. And his threat once and for all. Remember, Seto, he taught all of them how to duel, so he's the number one dude right now. Boom. Deck cost 1184. Now, Seto, he doesn't fuck around. He's really, really tough. Uh, we'll go over all the preparations for battling him next time. I guess I'll drop a save. You know, we can still battle Richard, even though he's fucking dead now. Uh, and actually, on this side of the story, believe it or not, Seto is like, uh, he's the second to last boss, basically. We fight Seto, and then it's the boss of the game for this side of the story, so... Uh, let me drop a save, and then next time it will be on to Seto!